Hello students. Welcome to another session of mathematics. Today, in this session, we are going to study about data handling. Before we start, let's understand that what do we mean by data? What do we mean by data? Well, data is an information like the marks obtained in the class test, the age of each child in the class, the weight of each child in the class, etc. So we can say that data is an information which can be in the form of numbers, words, pictures or digits. It provides us with the facts. And by organizing this information in different ways, we can make it easier to read and answer questions and solve problems. So we'll see how this data can be handled and what are the different ways by which we can answer to the following questions. Now, let's see what do we mean by data handling. Data handling is the way in which data can be represented graphically to give a clear idea of what it represents. It is easier to interpret and organize data using graphical representation. On the basis of its representation, data can be categorized into three different parts that is tellies, bar graphs and pictographs. Now we'll be seeing one by one about these tellies, bar graphs and pictographs. Now let's see what do we mean by tellies. A tele chart is a table with tele marks. It can help you in counting objects that belong to different groups. Now, in this coming example, we can see how the tele marks are being used for each number. This is known as tele marks. Now, let's understand what do we mean by bar graphs. A bar graph can be defined as a chart or a graphical representation of data, quantities or numbers using bars or strips. Bar graphs are used to compare and contrast numbers, frequencies or other measures. As you can see in this example, different strips are drawn against each number. It shows that how many children they like red color, blue color, green, yellow or pink. This data is represented by a bar graph. Now let's understand what do we mean by pictograph. A pictograph as the name suggests, it's a graph that uses pictures to show the total number for each term. In a pictograph, each picture represents certain number of items, which can be well understood with the help of an example. Over here, we have to find out that which is the favorite fruit by the child. Here, one smiley represents one vote. As we can see through the pictures that an apple is liked by the most and the grapes is liked by the least number of students. So this is how the data is represented by different forms that is tellies, bar graphs and pictographs. This is the way to handle data and represent it graphically with the help of pictures or tele marks or bar graphs. I hope you all have enjoyed today's session.